so he made an observation that those two frequencies were in parallel years ago broadcasting CW from Japan. The low powered JG2XA is an HFD project, meaning high frequency Doppler. That silent had been that station had been silent for a long time. So a carrier key first noted that 8006 also had an open carrier, which was as he then also heard. So who is broadcasting these new daily open carriers? Well, it is JG2XA. More news from Mr. Kumant Sabah says he got a reply by email. It resumed operation. Osokawa at the University of Electrocommunication says I was in charge of sending okay, until last year after Mr. Tomizawa retired. I am taking over the transmission and reception system. Thanks for informing us that we could receive two transmitted waves. Currently, we started trial operation. We were resuming stationary observation at frequencies. Continuous carrier is being carried out so far. But I'm trying to add a call sign, presumably, in CW that would be easy to distinguish. This is a pilot operation. We have a close to comfort round 52. So it seems the OH is running a three hour program loop. The same show is being heard every three hours. So on March 8th, he heard the beginning of the English lesson. At 12 30 minutes. One of the announcers was Happy Isaac. It's on the line. The Isaac Communication Center, ICC, responsible for these English lessons. EBS Radio Tour, Easy Fun. Our doctor, we have to do the short transmitters in Monaco and Monday. It's first recorded last week. Two transmitters, we're going to show you radio over here. They have been heard during the following week on a somewhat irregular, sporadic basis. However, of particular interest is the domestic service on 5995 in the evenings. Cameron Mendes' phone reports on Saturday, March 9th. 